All right. All right, this is the first solar test for my Passport. This is the uh, system I came up with. Uh, it's portable, so you can take the panels off. I didn't want roof panels, um, so I opted for this setup. Everything is removable. So I used some Invisiclips up here. All I do is I get my first panel and second panel ready by overlapping the two holes. And then I just take my first panel and latch it in place like so. These are magnetic clasps on the bottom. So all I have to do is release the panel. Those are 80 pound grip. So once I do that, the panel snaps into place. Second panel, same thing. Just bring the panel over, hook it into place, drop it down. Everything is all pre-wired, so I can just drop the wiring down like that and leave it. And I have an aircraft connector. It is keyed, so it only goes one way. And basically, I have the watertight connector here. You simply unscrew the cap and plug it in. Now, inside the cab, I basically have the pass-through here, just like the house where I could put the wire through. We use a 30 amp service, so I could plug right in there. I got one free on the Jupiter Pure, and I'm using the Power Queen MPPT controller, which is mounted to these aluminum rails that were basically for a solar panel. Everything is bolted into place. Um, everything is fused. I got double wire, uh, two zero coming in, uh, good for 450. I'm waiting for the uh, battery caps from Amazon. And basically, uh, to power the system up, you simply go up here to the circuit breaker, you power that first. Uh, this is in storage mode. The MPPT controller will come online. Once that comes online, you get one solid green light. It shows the battery voltage. Then you can come out here and finally connect your panels. So here, we're just gonna go ahead and connect that. You just basically take this connector, it's keyed, one side's flat, one side's pinned. There's the flat side, there's the pin side. Plug it together. See, it only goes one way, so you can't make a mistake. That's that way. Once you connect them, screw the two connectors together, and there you go. You're on solar power. Got a quick disconnect for everything for the uh, truck or the house. If you ever want to shut off the 12 volt, you just flip the perco switch that shuts it off. We also added this for the electric jack. Uh, so you don't have to have it hooked up to the truck. You could just take the electric jack plug, plug it right in, raise and lower the uh, trailer as necessary. So that's just basically uh, Harbor, uh, this was uh, not Harbor Freight, um, Northern Tools. So basically this just comes off and once you, uh, once you pull this through, you can actually pull it through and just simply connect it. And now you have your jack. To level out when you're done, unplug it, click it back in the jack. And that's it. So I got uh, 260 watts of solar power, flexible panels. Uh, they parallel together and then directly into the connector. Then you got a Bluetooth app for the phone. So you can monitor the power uh, being generated and how much amperage you're using. When you're said and done with the unit, just literally unplug it, lift them off, disconnect, store the panels. That's it. Nice and easy.